What's up guys, welcome back, Kelly with Droid Life, and uh, as you can see, I've got it. I've got the Moto X here, it's official. We spent all day in press events talking about it with Motorola, them telling us the inspiration behind it, all of the stuff it can do, the customizations, all of those things. And uh, yeah, this is it. So uh, without we do an unboxing, we'll have tons more galleries. We'll talk about the wood backs, the colored backs, which carry you to customize it through everything. There's gonna be so much going on, but let's just do an unboxing first, you know, keep it simple. And uh, as you can tell, the packaging, really, really minimal. So Motorola sort of made it obvious that this is the first sort of googly phone. I think they even use that term. Um, it's really sort of like the Google leadership come to Motorola and this is like the product that they've made. So if we go ahead and unbox it, there is the device. I actually took the uh, Verizon version in white. I'm gonna set that aside for now. The rest of the packaging, you've got sort of a bunch of guides and stuff in here. Then you've got a white USB um, sort of charger and cable. And then I'm gonna assume this is gonna be a SIM tool, although I haven't verified that, but I'm gonna assume it's a SIM tool and this does actually take nano SIM. So that rumor that came out the other day said it was gonna be nano SIM was absolutely spot on. So let's toss that aside and let's uh, see if we can't get the device out. So here it is, this is the white version. Um, you're gonna see both black and white versions come to the carriers. Um, I went ahead with the white Verizon version and uh, you know this phone feels remarkable in hand, it really does. They've uh, they spent a ton of time shrinking down the bezels, both top, bottom, and sides, so it's almost all display. Now it is a 4.7 inch 720p display. It's essentially the same internals as you got with the uh, with the new droids. You know, it's that dual core Snapdragon S4 Pro with the X8 mobile computing system, so it's optimized. 10 megapixel camera on the back, 2 megapixel camera on the front, and uh, it's sort of got this nice texture to it. They've really done some really nice things to make it. Um, one of the best feeling phones in hand I've seen in a really long time. Like you hold this thing in your hand and it just feels, it feels small, but you know it's not. It has a 4.7 inch display. So uh, again, they've really, really done a nice job of optimizing everything here. And uh, again, we'll talk about colors and stuff like that later, but you will be able to customize the back. The front can either be white or black, though that could change in the future, but the back can be a variety of colors. You can also change the accents around like the camera and the buttons on the side. And they're really going to let you do some cool customizations with this. And I really can't wait to show you guys everything else that's going on here. But for now, this is just an unboxing of the brand new Moto X. Actually, we might as well turn it on for you if we will. You guys can see the boot animation. Uh, you can actually customize this as well. So the first, when you go through the customization setup, you can actually have it say a saying down there. Like you could say Droid Life or Hi Kellen or something like that. So you can do that. Um, but there's the uh, fancy boot animation. You know, we'll do a whole review. We'll obviously do some more hands-on tours and things like that. Um, and for those that are worried about Verizon branding on it, you've got a Verizon logo right there, and that's it. Again, the phone doesn't say Motorola anywhere. It's not a droid, so it's not going to say that, but uh, you've got a lot of stuff going on there. This is just a quick unboxing. We'll be back with a whole bunch more. Droid life, peace.